with rugby, obviously, there's a certain amount of tradition in, in everything that, that we do with it, and, and the kit's just another extension of that. Obviously, the, the, what we've got so far has is, is been a really good blend of the modern day rugby style and you know, that, that, that really old school tradition, which I think has uh, been a fantastic combo. We've had it for the last couple of weeks while this little heat wave's been on. The kit's stood up to it, the amount of sweat that's been coming out of some of the boys and the fact that we've, uh, we've had a lot of input on the, the design of it and, and how it was going to be, you know, the, the end product's fantastic. As players, what we need mainly is something that works for us. We need to be able to be in the gym in it, be on the pitch in it. Um, obviously, we train hard, we push ourselves, and we need to be able to have a material that's breathable, that's, that's strong, that's durable. Um, it has to look nice as well. So, me and one of the other boys, Luke Baldwin, we went down and met with the guys at VX3 and chatted through with a designer and, and just talking through stuff we liked. and didn't like colourways that we wanted and they ended up coming up with this design that we've got now so I'm pretty happy with it. We were lucky that we got a decent involvement and got a bit of a say in it. Yeah, we're happy with the end product. It does have to look good but at the same time it has to be a material that, that, can, that can fit us nicely and, and survive the wear and tear of both uh, the stuff we do in the gym and the, the full contact rough stuff on, out on the pitch.